Climate change literacy to me means understanding the repercussions of your actions. When you put your, your consumption in the context of how it's affecting other people, I think an important component of that is by consuming this, I'm also depleting uh, natural resources from other people. Um, and so although it seems like I can afford this, I think it's also important to put it, to understand that you have a larger cost that is associated with the consumer culture. To me, climate literacy really has multiple components. We have our water system, our ecosystem, and humans are also part of that system. So climate literacy is understanding how, how all of those components interact and affect each other. And where climate adapt adaptation research comes in is understanding how the human component influences our climate and how we can adapt to or mitigate those changes. So there's two components of climate change literacy. The first is climate science literacy, an ability to understand and critically think about claims that are being made about our changing climate. So an ability to distinguish fact from fiction when it comes to scientific claims about our changing climate, as well as an ability to understand uh, policy and social discussions and how other factors can influence claims that individuals are making when it comes to our climate. The second component of climate change literacy is a belief in our climate change efficacy. So an ability to understand how our actions impact the climate as a whole. So how things like driving less or turning off lights can help slow down the process of climate change. So I think that question uh, can really be divided into two other questions. So the first is, what is climate literacy? And then the second is, what does it mean to me? Why do I care about being climate literate? I care about carbon dioxide enters the atmosphere, it causes climate change, there are a lot of problems associated with climate change, a lot of costs to humans and natural systems. And so I really work on how can we address those costs. On the second question, what does it mean to me to be climate literate? Why do I care? Well, I mean, climate change is a huge problem that faces the world, right? I mean, it's going to affect us in the United States. It's going to affect people around the world. It's going to affect all sorts of different ecosystems and natural systems. And so um, I get, it's very rewarding, I guess, for me to work on a problem that large and to try to think about the solutions to it. So climate change literacy means to me giving people the tools and kind of analytical framework to understand climate change and, and to really be able to make sense of the claims and the information that's out there. It's really easy to get caught up. I think there's a lot of controversy about climate change um, and sometimes it's hard to tell what is fact and fiction. And so giving people the skills to really decide for themselves and understand what is being talked about in the public sphere and then they can go forward and use that to, to really contribute to the political debate. And I think once we get people to a sufficient level of climate literacy, the debate will move from is climate change happening, which is really scientifically settled, to climate change is happening, but what should we do about it? And that's much more of a social, moral question that I think everyone should really be a part of.